Hello, Nicholas. Congratulations on winning this Broadcasting Press Guild Award for still being alive. And at your age, it is a, a bit of an achievement. So well done. Uh, I first met you over 30 years ago when we were talking about Just a Minute on another TV show that we were involved in at that point. And you have been an excellent chairman of that show since 1967, an extraordinary 52 years. I think the way that you run that show, the way you sort of hand out your decisions is admirable. Some people get sometimes annoyed when you go against them, but let's say, let's just pick a fictitious person. Let's call him Giles Brandreth. Sometimes he or she gets a bit annoyed at what you say, but only because they're so desperate to win. But you're very good at bringing in other competitors to make sure if somebody hasn't been speaking for a while, you try and sort of judge the judgment towards them a little bit. And I think that's admirable. You're a very fair-minded, beautifully dressed individual. And uh, I know now that sometimes you get a bit worried because your legs aren't working as well as they used to. And as I said to you recently, at least your brain's working and your legs may not be. You don't want it the other way round because otherwise you go for a long walk and not know where you were. So Nicholas, uh, you are, to me, an absolute hero. When you meet one of your heroes, when you're getting into show business and you admire somebody from a long time ago, and I remember you on such shows as the Arthur Haynes Show, in fact, you're one of the very few people still working who's mentioned in the Bible. And you are an extraordinary exponent of your art. So urbane, smooth, beautifully turned out, even-tempered, a magnificent, handsome man, even at the advanced age that you are now. And I think there can be no greater person in the world to win this Lifetime Achievement Award. And I think it's remarkable that your career has lasted as long as it has, because let's face it, your first publicity photo was a cave painting, which was recently discovered in Spain, dating back to the uh, prehistoric era. And uh, Nicholas, I'd like to pay full tribute to you by saying you are one of my best friends, an absolutely marvellous man. I love you to bits and don't drink too much. See you next time in just a minute. Thank you.